Strikes Out Boyd. Our house has been overrun, guys. I came back in and there were zombies in our house. The whole place was teeming, so I've actually fallen back uh, to a, another bit of a quiet uh, community up here. I've been using the axe to kill uh, as many zombies as I can, and we've actually leveled up our fire axe to an evil axe. Here we are, this is the house I've been sleeping at. Uh, it seems to be far enough away from all the activity. It's not too far of a run up from our base. The sooner we can get some explosives and some molotovs, uh, the better off we're going to be. Alright, there's just a couple here. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Enough with the gunfire already. We get it. Just let us get back into our house. Take care of whoever is inside. Alright, we got two. Let's call them out. How many of you are in there? I assume they broke in through one of our barricaded windows, because we did have our doors closed. Unless they broke down a wall. Build a wooden door. Oh, I wasn't, uh, I wasn't sure we were going to do it this episode, guys. But we did it. Resecured. Hello everyone, my name is Noma San. Welcome back to another episode of Project Zomboid Season 4 with Adam Sinclair. We are picking up here shortly after where we last left off. Last episode we took back our house again. We won't be giving up that easy, guys. Uh, I've cleaned up some of the bodies of the zombies that were in here that we killed. And I believe one of them had a machete on them. So let's check the bodies here. I'm pretty sure, oh no, a survival axe. That's what it was. Okay, so let's pick up that survival axe. Always a good weapon to have. Uh, but I believe there was a uh, machete on one of the bodies outside. Uh, one of you guys left a comment about that a couple episodes ago. So we'll see if we can pick that up today. It sounds like we got some zombies at the door. It sounds like they're at the back door there. So let's uh, head out the front. Might even be one out here, too. Of course, we did uh, barricade off our little porch here, so this should be somewhat safe. Today, what I want to do, before we head out here and start killing zombies, is we had a suggestion to start maybe walling off some of the streets in our neighborhood to help uh, control the zombie population. So we might uh, start planning to do that this episode. So let's just hop out here. Take care of these zombies that have, uh, oh my god. <laughs> Alright, we'll close that. And, uh, that's a, a few more zombies than I was expecting to take care of right off the bat. So let's, uh, start bringing them up here. We'll take out a couple if we can. Or not. Or not. <laughs> Too many. It's ridiculous, guys. This season is ridiculous. Okay. Well, let's get them all up this way. We'll do another loop. And, uh, yeah, we'll start planning out where we're going to put walls on the roads here to hopefully, uh, I don't know, make things a bit more manageable in our neighborhood. S Slide around there. Yeah, more broken windows. I'm surprised there are still even windows to break in our neighborhood. Seems like they've broken pretty much every pane of glass out there. So we got a couple. Actually, we got more than a couple. There's always more than just a couple, aren't there? Unless it looks like the majority of them have moved up the street there, so that's good. Take care of this guy with our evil axe, which we are waiting. Hopefully th this episode will get a new name for our evil axe. Might as well take care of uh, these two stragglers before we attract another big group. Just 
a reminder, the evil on our evil axe doubles the minimum and maximum damage for the weapon. So that's good. Okay, if that little group stays over there for now, we should probably take them out. Um, we got some people kind of coming down one by one. There are several up there. My god. Well, I did say last episode we'd probably just be spending a couple episodes killing zombies, so maybe that's what we'll do for the first half of this episode, and then we can worry about planning out these walls. But I think what we'll try and do is build a wall from our house across to this house, at least. And then maybe from this house on the corner up to that house there. And... I guess across the alley there we can build one. Let's uh, see if we can't take out this group here. We got a can of open pears here we're gonna have for a little dinner. Try and drag them out in small groups here. And here come three. Good. No runners, or uh, quick ones, I should say. Thank God there are no runners. Could you imagine <laughs> doing build 32 on runners? That would be a bit ridiculous. As crazy as things are right now in New Denver, I do have to say, they aren't as insane as... Uh, our Winter is Coming Challenge down in Muldra. Our weekend series. Now that is ridiculous. The amount of zombies in that one. It's nigh impossible to uh, loot any of the homes in Muldra. Let's stick to our main series here. We got one, two, three, four, five down there. Or six. Let's start start taking some of them out. Alright, see me zombie. Someone see me. There we go. Take you guys out. Oh my god. They just come out of the trees, they come out of other homes. Quite ridiculous. Groaning all the time. Make sure no one's sneaking up behind us. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> that was close. Alright, let's get her while she's down. Ah, not quite. <laughs> Come on, evil axe. You're supposed to be better than this. Oh man. Posing a bit of a problem for us. Alright, come on. Fall down, fall down. I wanna take care of you. There goes one. I'm not that tired. It shouldn't be taking us this long. There we go. Okay. Oh, looks good. Still that group. This group's still milling about. The garage over there. Alright. Here we go. A few more. Then we'll head inside for, uh, get some shut eye. Couple more zombie kills today, please. Another skill point. Nice. I don't think we have anything to put it into at the moment. I'll open up the window in a second. So we gotta take care of these two as well now. Or three. Jeez. 
these ones are, are fast ones. A bit hard to take on in groups. There we go. Unless you get lucky like that. Our axe is still doing uh, quite well, condition-wise. It did reset the durability when we got that uh, name. Well, I would have expected it to have degraded somewhat by now. Okay, let's take a look at our skill points here. Actually, we do have a couple we can throw into our blade. And we have five uh, skill points sitting here, so we might as well use up both of these on our accuracy and our maintenance. Since we are using a lot of our axe. Let's just rest here for a little bit. I do hear some more knocking on our house. And uh, I don't hear it anymore, actually. Did they break through something? No, it looks like they're still knocking on that uh, window there. Oh, and there are quite a few of you. I kind of wanted to get to sleep, guys. I think getting these walls up will be uh, very important. Oh god. Fall down! Jesus. Oh, that was a swing and a miss. Alright. This might not be, uh... Working out tonight. Might want to just lose these guys. Although, where to lose them is another question. So I'm afraid we've dragged zombies all over the place. I don't even know where a safe place to loop would be. Let's try this house. Nope, looks like there's a few there. Oh yes, that may not have worked at all. <laughs> Alright, well... They still see us, one does, two do. Alright, we lost most of them. And there's still someone knocking on our window. Jeez. Is it just one? No, it's two. Alright, well, let's uh, try and lose these guys, or might be able to kill one or two of them. Do I get lucky? No. No, I don't think so anyway. No. Okay, well, where do we drag these guys? loop around this house. It's so dark. We just go through? Dare we go through the house? That might not be a good idea. Yeah, that might not be a good idea, Nomis. <laughs> ah! Just leave us alone. Oh, and that group's moving. Alright. Oh god. Yeah, this isn't working. This is not working. I don't really want to track that whole group though up there. Probably should have just gone inside when we finished off that first group. Alright, we'll drag them. Do another loop around the house here. Okay. Will that have been enough? When all else fails, continue to loop. I think they all lost us. Okay. Let's get inside. Get to bed. In the morning, if it's uh, clear enough, which I don't expect it to be. Where's our 
Where's our door? There we go. Close that. It's still knocking. I think we gotta go to bed, guys. Hopefully they don't uh, break in. I think this is just our new reality, though. Zombies always knocking on our doors. Should get some lights on in here, too. Alright, let's sleep for eight hours. We'll pick up in the morning, take care of what we need to, and then we'll start making some walls. Still hear the knocking, so at least that means they probably haven't broken in. Let's have, uh, I guess we need to go down and grab some more food. I don't think we have any else, anything else in our backpack right now. Hopefully they didn't break in. They do sound quite close. Into the kitchen, please. Thank you. Alright. Let's grab a can of apples. Get our can opener out. Yeah, we might as well grab some carrots too, maybe. And we'll have some apples for breakfast. Like so. We're a little sad. But, uh... I think we'll, we'll perk up once we get some zombie blood on our axe. Alright. What's the deal this morning? Who do we got over at our door? Or our windows? No one? Where'd they go? They must be behind. They must be. Are they? Yes. A couple. Quickly now. Oh, they did break in. I didn't even notice that. Okay. Well, let's call everyone out of our house. Damn. They like breaking into that. So that's where we're definitely going to need a, uh, a wall up. Really freaking out. Let's uh, take some more beta blockers. We've already gone through one packet of beta blockers. We got two left. Be nice to find some more. Should start using our uh, stomping a bit more. Save our axe, even though it's still quite high on durability. All right, is there anyone else in here? I think there is. The curtain is up, so I can't really see in there. Maybe we should check this out first. Well, it's a good thing we got these other doors on last episode. Oh, and you're trying to break out that one? You silly fool. Alright, so we need more planks. Patch that window up. I think we will start chopping trees. There are some planks here. Let's grab these ones. Actually, we already have uh, a couple stacks here as well. Take out our hammer. Patch up this window. Speed that up a bit. Now, how are we doing for nails? I don't see any nails in our backpack. We still have 14 on us. And, let's see here, what do we have? I don't see any nails on our shelf. We have screws. There we go, box of nails and some loose nails. All right, so about 170 or so nails left. That should be enough for uh, what we need to do today. All right, let's get this patched up again. Was this the same window? I think it was the other window that they broke last time. Alright, there we go. Just gonna drop these other planks for now. What we're gonna do... Start chopping some trees out back. Oh, 
Oh, there's, oh my god, there's another big group. Jace. Jace Louise. Here, let's uh let's drag them away from us. So I do want to start cutting some trees down, so we're gonna take them down for a little jog down the road. Most of them anyway. Maybe down here and then we'll loop around this yard, I guess. Uh, some of them are going back up there again. Let's try and get them all. We had one suggestion to drag everyone down. There's a, a bridge, a river, down this direction. Uh, with a bridge that we could uh, maybe lure everyone to and then burn the bridge and burn a bunch of zombies, but we're gonna need to find some jerry cans first. We wanna take that on. Okay. That's a big group. Never mind. Oh, that's a big group there too. Let's slide down. Nope, can't go that way. We'll go this way. Let's grab some more hinges while we're here. Okay, we should be alright now. There's that group there. Now I am a little worried about how much noise chopping down trees is going to make. That's kind of why I wanted to uh, lure that big group away. There are still... Six up here and more moving in towards the house. Fantastic. Oh, let's uh, switch out to our axe here. <laughs> uh, we'll equip it with both hands. If we make things go a little bit quicker here. Alright, let's take a look at our stats here. What are we at? One month, five days. Oh, here we go. 700th kill. You shall be the lucky lady. 700 kills. Okay, one lady, two ladies on the wall. Chop down a tree and kill a zombie at the same time. I don't really want to hit my wall. Zombie. Alright, I think we got things under control here. Now, as long as that big group doesn't move down, let's just take a look up here. That group's still mingling around. Let's start chopping trees. Oh, and did I just break down our wall too? Okay. That's not good. Let's get our saw out. Get that ready to go. And let's, uh, let's build a wall there before... Bunch of zombies come into our porch area. Pick up those planks. And I guess we sh could just use. Actually, I only picked up one plank there. Could just start using uh, these lumber stacks too. Before we start chopping trees. Have some more apples. Good. Let's unpack this, just one at a time. So we may need to drop a bunch in a hurry. All right, build a wall right there. Good, let's get our ax out again. Okay, they're still sitting there. Those two are kind of slowly wandering down. Let's take... oh god. Let's see what happens here, guys. They are all moving that way. Okay, let's head inside. Let everyone pass by. We'll head upstairs. Take a look where these guys are all going. Uh, let's just drop that lumber stack. Alright, we're pretty slow right now. 
Just keep an eye on people. This group's probably moving past. Good. As long as they keep moving, we'd be fine with that. With any luck, some of these gunshots will end up helping us. Alright, they've uh, decided to stop moving. Let's take a look out. Oh, we don't have any windows right here, do we? Oh, we do have one. Okay. I don't hear anyone knocking, so... At least they haven't come right to our doorstep again. It's a little bit of a slower episode today, guys. I think, I think that gunshot probably helped us out. Let's just drop these planks for a second. We're going to take care of uh, these zombies. We might rest up a bit on our deck chair. I should sleep for an hour. See if that does the trick. Yeah, it doesn't quite rest us completely. Try that. There we go. Alright, getting dark again. Near the end of another day. But we should take care of these guys because they are pretty close to our house. There we go. That was a good exchange. Excellent. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to really make sure we're rested up before we take on these groups. Otherwise, it just takes too long. So we were we were fully rested up there and uh, made pretty quick work of them. Okay, I think after this lady. Should be good to start putting up some walls. Alright, yeah, got ten planks here. Let's pick these up. Oh no, we got we got uh, a couple more coming. Never mind. Okay, maybe we won't get to the walls today. Maybe we'll just be killing all day today. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Picked up those plants. I didn't want to speed up time at all. Oh god. He's right there. Is there just one? Right there. There's just one. We'll take him out. Because that's where I want to start building. Okay. Took him out. Okay, so here's what we're doing. We're gonna build a wall out across here. We'll figure out something for the uh, wooded area back there. This is what we're gonna do for right now, guys. Start building a wall out this direction across the road to connect to the other house. That's all the planks I have there. Let's go pick up Another stack. Have some more apples. Unpack that. Close the door. Alright, where do we finish? Right there. Okay. Build a wooden wall. Let's try building with the dowels at some point here. Maybe once we run out of nails. And I'll put a doorway on the road. Don't have quite enough planks left here to do that right now, but that's what it's gonna be, guys. We'll build that wall across there. We'll do the same on kind of each side around our house, and then we'll start building more walls out uh, from there once we get a little bit of a uh, Secure zone established. Let's head to bed one more time. 
Close that door. Make sure we close all our doors behind us. Head upstairs. Probably best to sleep on the top floor, just in case. And maybe what we should do... Can we build a uh, lamp? A light pole? A lamp post? It's kind of annoying being so dark here. Do we have the skills to do that? Bill, lamp on a pillar. Flashlight, one plank. Yeah, we can do it. Okay. Let's go grab... Do we have a flashlight on us? No, let's go grab a flashlight. We got the rope. We got a plank here. Let's uh, pick this up. Start building some lamp posts. And we got one flashlight. Okay. So let's put that. Uh, I think the main floor is fine. It's really up here was the dark, really dark area. I guess we'll build it over here. Rotate that. I guess we'll just put it there. There. That'll be a bit better. Alright, turn that off for now. And before we end the episode, because we are around a half hour right now, let's go cut down some trees. I said we wanted to do from the very beginning. And alright, I think we're okay here. That. So I think this uh, should work. Uh, it won't look pretty. I can probably guarantee you off the bat, but uh, we'll just keep working away at it. And hopefully, after a while, uh, we'll have a secure base. What we could do is build a wall from here down to that garage as well. And then over from the garage up to like the alley and then up to that shed and that could uh, kind of secure a little yard for us as well so that could be an option we're gonna need a lot of lumber though so I already went through a couple dozen planks just doing this little section of the wall I think the more trees we get out of here, the better. Less place for, uh, fewer places for zombies to hide. So I'll cut down some of this. We'll come back and we'll put up a few more walls to try and get this one finished across the road. That'll probably be it for today. Take out these zombies, I guess, first. Before we cut. They did hear the, us chopping down the tree. I thought they might. Okay. I think she's probably far enough away. I don't want to attract more than we need to. Alright, so we'll be back in a couple seconds here, guys. Okay. I have uh, cut down several trees here. Sawn up some logs, grab some more nails. Let's try and get this finished. They've moved a little bit closer. I think we're still okay for right now, though. Oh, as they continue to move closer, let's try and get this done quickly as we can. So put one more wall. And I think uh, we'll put a door here. A door frame. Right there. So obviously we'll want to be able to uh, come in and out of our own compound. Oh, here comes a zombie. Here comes a couple zombies. Time to drop some planks. Get our axe equipped again. And we might need to just take care of all these guys. And we'll end the episode, I think. With our evil axe. 
I rested up just before. So we should be good to go here. So we make some quick work of these zombies. I was hoping to get another name on the axe today, but uh, we might. Looks like we'll be waiting until tomorrow. Okay. Well, here, let's try and get this finished. We're so close. Saw those last two logs up there. Probably shouldn't be uh, picking up with our back to uh, the road. We're almost to the house across the street. Oh, there's a zombie there too, knocking on the, the wall. She hasn't seen- oh god, <laughs> there's one there. Alright, alright. I might have to finish this up in between episodes, guys. This episode is starting to drag on. So we'll call it here for the day. We have a lot of zombies to search through as well. Thanks a lot for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Leave me some comments below, what do you think of our plan here to put up some walls? Thank you for the suggestion in the comments. So I think it's a pretty good idea, I think it should work. As long as we uh, can get them up fast enough before the next uh, big sound event, like a gun blast or something like that. But well, that'll do it for today. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, hit that like button if you enjoyed. And until next time, I'll talk to you all later. Thank you.